hello everyone it's me asmr welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorials and today i'll show you this type of pop-up from the cup design or manipulation photo manipulation so how to do that let's start the tutorial if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notification so i have the source file and you can uh, just uh, watch it out how i have done this so this one this one is smart object just if i right press this one or double press this one you'll get the full version so here uh, one by one i will see here is the light that means levels and here is gradient and then the cloud one and then cloud two then elements like um, birds and there's aeroplanes and then the cloud and here is the cup so actually what i have done here cup uh, actually this one the pop-up and the shadow and this one uh, inside the cup and here the the upper portion of the cup and the light adjustment here and then the cloud another one and background so i got these stock images or png files from the kisspng.com and i'll provide you the download link in my video description so let's start the tutorial i'm closing all the things out so go to the file and take a new options from here i'll take the artboard which is the 2560 and 1440 and the pixel or resolution 200 or you can make it 300 as you wish hit the create button you'll get this one and make this one fit with the screen and then go to the adjustment and go to the solid color i'll pick up solid color which is like this type of things or you can make this one like 50 percent gray how to fix get the 50 percent gray color go to the edit options and go to the fill options from here you'll get the 50 percent gray color and hit ok so you'll get the 50 percent gray or if i use the solid color what is the benefits the solid color benefits you can just double click here the square box and you can change out the color of the background anytime anywhere so i'll prefer this one for this detail and i'm deleting the 50 percent gray color okay that's fine and then go to the file and place embedded options and place up the cup which is like that or you can use this cup or whatever you want so after that just make it smaller like that that's good and hit the tick button if i make it black let's see what is the thing here i don't need this smoke so right press and crystallize this one and make it mask after that just get the brush tool from here and get the first one brush flow and opacity like that and just you can delete this one make sure that this one is black just because of i just used here the white mask that's good and again i'll go back to this one so i'll use a uh, light or other things go to the adjustment and brightness and contrast make the brightness only this one in mask options and brightness and contrast will be like that so background color will be this yeah this one is good and after that i'll just make two things the group and give the name cup so after that uh, i'll cut down this portion so i'll select this one go to the pen tool press p from the keyboard you'll get the pen tool so i'll cut this portion so select here so right press and make selection and then press ctrl j i'll just okay that's good and i'll use that thing for the like clipping mask or other stuffs so i'll use here this color okay this one is good okay now i'll go to the file and place embedded again and here is the kremlin uh, moscow russia so i'll make this one fit with that so that's good and here I'll just right press and crystallize the layer and just mask it out this portion and press ctrl 
J and right press and delete layer mask okay so one thing here two things just I used here uh, one is just mask and another one is not mask so here I'll cut out or cut down the extra areas how to do that so go to the paint tool and cut out the areas like this photo more precisely accurate with that so right press and here the make selection options and now I'll increase the opacity now I'll delete this portion press ctrl D so our major work is done that means the thing which I have what I have done here so this portion the upper portion I just made the same and this portion which is the like uh, the lower portion which is like that so you're getting here the pop-up portion but we need to add shadow over here so I'll select these two things or uh, press control just take a new blank layer and go to the shadow make the black type color go to the brush tool and you can brush over here so like that and right press and create clipping mask use this one in upper portion and create clipping mask so place the opacity down here here is the portion you can just right press press ctrl T and right press and make it work and adjust this portion slightly a little bit yeah it will be more precise with that so the Kremlin or the, the like Moscow pop up from the cup that's good you can adjust the shadow and highlight whatever and however you want then go to the file and place embedded options here's some cloud I downloaded I'll just get this cloud over here and make the cup in a downside so that's good right press and restylize the cloud layer press ctrl T and make it a little bit smaller or you can place this cloud below the layer which is the cup okay that's good create clipping mask okay that's good and now I'll use this type of shadow that's good so that's good in this portion I'm just I'm getting um, unnecessary things so I have to delete that so go to the eraser tool and erase those portion which is really not necessary so those are disturbing and make your design like spoiled that's good so be careful when you are erasing just because of main thing could be erased okay that's good and the color will be yeah this one is good color that's fine and now cloud will be like that press ctrl T and make it a little bit rotate and then press ctrl J and use this one in upper portion so here outside of the cup layer so I'm collapsing this one press ctrl T and make it a little bit smaller and right press and flip horizontal that's good and go to the file and place submitted options from here I'll replace the bars PNG files and just place over here that's good and right press restylize so giving the name but and giving the name cloud that's fine and now go to the file and place embedded options and insert this one and hit the tick button press ctrl T to make the size like that of the airplane and then press ctrl J of the cloud make this one another copy press ctrl T and right press and flip horizontal like that or you can make it like that yeah that's good so it's almost done so you can place out the birds portion or the aeroplane portion whatever you want literally our design is ready now i'll just make it mask 
or make it merge actually go to the filter and nick collection color fix pro 4 so color fix pro 4 is a plugins of the photoshop if you want to get the download link of the color fix pro 4 please check out my video description here are lots of bunch of preset or lots of preset here the cross processing lots of method over here which one you want and whatever you want you can use that so in this case i will use here l02 and hit the ok button it will take time to load it up and give you the final output so that's good you can use the light setup or other stuffs go to the levels options and you can use like that it's fine so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and until the next video i may see when you signing out today bye bye